Hello everyone, I'm going to teach you how to make a simple stamping tool to create different textures in your piece. All right, these stamps are two-sided stamps right, with different textures on each side. Right? Here's another one. This one actually has a pair of uh, pliers stamped into it, which is pretty interesting. Um, what we're going to do is start with a small piece of clay and basically roll a coil. Right? You're going to take your coil, right? hold it steady, and push firmly down on one side. Right? Continue to rotate and continue to push down, right? transferring the thick clay outward. Okay? So I'm going to continue to stamp this down, nice smooth surface. Right? There is some texture in the canvas that I'm getting on my stamp. So you could continue to smooth that out either with your lightly with your thumb or you could actually uh, go over to a flat surface right and make it nice and smooth right. So for my stem I'm going to continue to blend upward right rotating right making it nice and even right. Think about the stamp as something you're going to have around your studio for a while. So you want to make it appear uh, nice, nicely done, right? visually ap appealing and uh, user friendly, no sharp edges. Okay, so always make sure your edges right, remain nice and smooth. Right? If you push down too much, right, you may get a sharp edge out here. You don't want to do that. Okay, All right, so this is my template. Right? I'm going to flatten both of my sides on a nice smooth board, right? And I'm going to take this and create my stamps. So I'm going to just use some basic tools. Um, I even like to use sometimes a pen, right? Which uh, creates a lot of interesting textures. Uh, just the pen cap itself, right? You push, you could create some, some dot patterns. Right? Very interesting, very flower-like. Right? And depending on how deep your textures are, it depends on how uh, well the stamp will work, okay? Um, you could even decorate the outside, right, of your stamp to create a different shape, right, for like the silhouette, right? I'll go back in, maybe I'll create some other marks here, right? The nice thing about clay is it has a memory. Whatever you do to it, right, it's going to remember. It's going to stay put. Right? And I'll get another sh shape right in there. All right, so that's one side of my stamp. And I could re-flatten this on a nice smooth surface right, if I want to make sure it's nice and even. All right, the other side, I'm also going to decorate, right, with some kind of pattern. Um, if you decide to draw into the clay, right, you wind up with a frayed edge and a burr, right, that comes to the surface. So you want to refine, right, whatever lines you draw with. And I like drawing with a pen tool, um, just to create nice thick lines, right? As the clay hardens, I could go back in, right, and really clean these lines up, okay? Because remember, we don't want any sharp edges in the end, okay? I could gradually clean it up if I, I'm careful, right, clean my tool, I make sure there's no crumbs left behind. All right, so there's another example, creating a simple stamp. And this could be used, fired, um, fired and used over and over right, throughout the course of the year. I usually have my students make about two of these um, and we swap them and share them among each other. Right? So a really nice uh, piece for the studio. Hope you guys enjoyed.